issue of loss of lives. Elections have often caused human rights abuses, loss of lives and serious injury. We are saddened by the unnecessary deaths of people in the country during the electoral period. And among them, there is the Embakasi East returning officer, Daniel Musioki, was abducted while on official duty and later found dead in Loitoktok. Secondly, there is uh, Brian Olunga, an aide of an aspirant who was shot dead at point blank range uh, by eventual electoral victor, Didmas Barasa. Thirdly, there is Eunice Nyambane, who was attacked and killed on Juja Road by rowdy crowds who attacked her family's car. Her child and husband are currently in hospital as a result. I wish to congratulate Kenyans for the restraint they have exercised despite the emerging concerns on the outcome of the 2022 elections. It has been a tumultuous season with positives and negatives that require acknowledgement and serious reflection if they are to enhance the electoral process that has remained deficient in trust over the years despite massive investment of hope and resources. Kenyan expected the IBC to conduct an election that is free and fair, simple, accurate, verifiable, secure, accountable, and transparent. It is these parameters that we're going to use this morning to evaluate the performance of the IBC. We have made the following observation of the electoral process. One, failure of the Kim's kit. Over 200 uh, Kim's kits failed to identify voters during voting. This translates in our view uh, in our view, actually, this translates to a lot of voters who may have been disfranchised. In many cases, it took the IBC many hours to allow the use of money or register to identify voters. Of, ...of elections by the IBC chairperson. On August 8th, uh, IBC chairperson uh, Chabkati announced that elections were cancelled in two counties, mainly Mombasa and Kakamega, and various other places like West, uh, like Pakot South, Kachaliba, uh, and Tarakanidi County, and of course there was Kitu Ruro. According to Chabkati, errors and other mixed up in the details and the images of candidates on the ballot papers rendered them unusable. However, Chabkati did not explain to voters how these errors had happened, as the Commission must have signed off uh, on proof copies of uh, ballot papers and attendant documents, uh, prescribed document specifications. This has had the effect of uh, disenfranchising voters and uh, offending the constitution which provides for them what elections shall be held. And of course we know the basis for cancellation of the elections is in the event of insecurity, um, and, uh, disaster and also violation of the Elections Act.